In this video, I am going to show you how to calculate the ln value of any complex number. Actually, uh, this complex logarithm is very complicated thing. But uh, what I am going to show you is very simple thing. Okay, uh, so let's begin with this simple complex number. Is it equals to um, r e to the i theta? Uh, we generally know there are three types of complex number we can write. First one is uh, general form, we said uh, coordination form. Second one is polar version, polar form. And this is uh, exponential method. So uh, now what I am going to do is uh, take the ln in both sides. LN. Okay. Uh, now I can simplify this ln is it equals to ln r plus ln e to the i theta. This gives us ln r plus i theta ln e. This equals to 1, 1 and we left with ln r plus i theta ln is it. This is very simple thing. So, what is the meaning of this R? R means uh, modulus of our complex number. Ln modulus is it. And this theta means theta means argument. Arg is it. So, if we uh, need to find the Ln value of any complex number, what we need to do? First thing is we need to find the modulus of our complex number. Second thing is uh, argument. So now I am going to show you how do we find the value of ln i. That's a very simple thing. So what we need first thing is modulus. Modulus of i equals to i. And argument of i equals to 5 over 2. Okay. These are very simple things. Okay, uh, this is argon plane. Uh, real is set. Imaginary is set. And uh, this I only have a uh, real uh, complex value. This, uh, this length equals to 1. And uh, this angle equals to 5 over 2. So that's why uh, I take these two things modulus of i equals to 1 and argument of i equals to 5 over 2. So uh, now I can write this ln i equals to ln modulus of z ln 1 plus uh, i argument of z equals to 5 by 2. Okay. I will erase this and we left with uh, ln i equals to ln 1 goes to 0 uh, okay i 5 by 2 as finally uh, we need to understand about this equation if we have a complex number and we need to find the ln value of that complex number we can use this general equation uh, and also uh, we can use this equation too. ln is a equals to um, 1 by 2 ln x square plus y square plus i tan inverse y over x okay if we have a complex number in general form, uh, coordination form, we can use this equation also. Okay, now uh, this is exponential method, this is general method. Okay, so uh, actually, this complex logarithm is very complicated thing. Now I want to find uh, ln 
i to the power n this value how do we find we can find that using this equation i phi by 2 into n okay uh, we can prove this equation using uh, the the Moivre's theorem okay this is very simple thing okay uh, now what will happen this n equals to uh, 4 that's the real question okay mm, I will erase this If this n equals to 4, ln i to the power 4 equals to i5 by 2 into 4. And this gives us uh, 2i5. ln i to the power 4. Okay. <clears throat> What's the value of this i to the power 4? Minus 1 square uh, root of minus 1 to the power 4 this equals to 1 as I mentioned this complex logarithm is very complicated thing so don't think about this and uh, you need to understand these two equations and uh, remember this one okay so if you need to write anything okay write it down <coughs> 